In this example, we will be using the Kubernetes provider for Terraform to demonstrate how to pass cloud provider resource attributes to a Kubernetes deployment. In this demo, we want to use external DNS to synchronize Kubernetes services and ingresses with DNS providers. However, external DNS as a Kubernetes deployment requires specific parameters from the DNS provider. This includes zone identifiers and DNS names. Without Terraform, we would use separate automation to retrieve the identifiers from the cloud provider. In this example, we use AWS Route 53. With Terraform, we can leverage the AWS Route 53 resource, create the zone with this resource, and pass the resource attributes to the Kubernetes deployment resource that is part of the Kubernetes Terraform provider. In this example, we have a Route 53 configuration and a Kubernetes deployment configuration for external DNS. When we examine the Route 53 configuration for Terraform, we use the Terraform AWS provider. This allows us to create a Route 53 zone resource with the subdomain dev. It also creates a record and links up the name servers. As part of this module, we also include an external DNS deployment configuration. This uses the Kubernetes deployment resource. When we deploy external DNS, we need the hosted zone identifier and name. This is typically retrieved using the AWS CLI or the AWS API. By using the Kubernetes provider for Terraform, we are able to retrieve the zone identifier by its resource attribute. For example, AWS Route 53 zone.dev.name and zone ID. This omits the step to retrieve the zone name and ID using a CLI or API command. In this example, we have already run the Terraform module to create the Route 53 hosted zone, as it takes time for the zone to be created. Now, we will be applying the difference. This will deploy external DNS as a Kubernetes deployment. Here, notice that it refreshes the state and retrieves the ID from the hosted zone. Terraform recognizes that the Kubernetes deployment for external DNS has not been created yet. It will then populate the hosted zone resource attributes into external DNS parameters. This allows external DNS to link the AWS Route 53 hosted zone we've created to the Kubernetes deployment and Kubernetes service of our application. When we apply, Terraform will deploy external DNS as a Kubernetes deployment.